Latvia is an amazing little country in Europe by the Baltic Sea. The capital of Riga is full of culture and the cobblestone streets in the old town speak history. On the countryside, pristine, untouched nature stretches for miles and miles and its coast offers the longest seashores of Europe. But just as in countries all over the world, Children are the most vulnerable group of society, and for different reasons, many children are being abandoned. 109 World set out to spend time with these children, spur their creativity and widen their horizon, while at the same time fundraise in order to provide them with a full four-year education, preparing for an independent life after leaving the orphanage. 28 participants traveled far to assemble under the same roof in Jurmala, Latvia. Different, but all devoted to make a positive impact on the hearts of children without that which others take for granted. Daily yoga made sure the fires within each were truly ignited. Focusing on connecting and empowerment, we all bonded in the struggle and bliss of moving and breathing together. Expressive arts, cooking, yoga and play gave us a platform to communicate, connect and teach each other the importance of unconditional love, the essence of human relationships, the importance of being present and cherishing the moment. We could never have imagined the treasures we would bring back home. These were days to feel things we hadn't felt before, days to see things from a new perspective, to learn what we didn't know we needed to learn, days to crack open. On the very last day, we began to grasp what had occurred during these few days. Some had their faith in humanity restored. Others found a strength inside themselves they barely knew existed. Saying goodbye reminded us of the fleetingness of things, of the importance of being in the moment and appreciating life as is. The moment of goodbye made us realize the impact we had had on them and them on us. No one was left untouched. And although we all carried some sadness in our hearts leaving this place and these children, the joy and love we had created together will last forever. What do you think of these last couple of days? I think it's been wonderful. And that you never know what to expect, but then it always ends up to be amazing. How awesome everyone was at cooking. Everyone was like, just got into it, did what they wanted, and it turned out so delicious. So I'm super proud and happy about everything. So more space to love, more space to be grateful for. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, Oh, it was amazing. I feel so much love inside of me and with everyone. And it's so nice to spend time with the kids and it's amazing how close they feel to us after just two days. So I really appreciate this moment. Oh, it was cool. I like, like it soccer to play, street and other games. And I like yoga for today. And art it was cool. And uh, did you like the food? Yes, it was amazing. The best part was uh, eating and playing with friends. I think the best thing that we're doing is coming to see it from close. Like I think you can see and research solutions for these kind of problems, but it's not until you go there. And I think that's the best part of 109, is going there and seeing it with your own eyes, and then it's when you know. Very true. Yeah.